There's some of the tiniest, most fragile babies, and they are receiving life-saving treatment that's growing in demand right here in Kansas City. Only here on 41 Action News, Ariel Rothfield explains. Research shows that human milk carries long-term benefits for babies, but there are times when a mother can't provide it, like when her child is born premature. That's when donors come in. Hi, girls. Nobody wants their child to end up here, but for Vivian and Helen Bunch's parents, they had no other choice. The twins were born six weeks early. It's scary and it's sad and it's a it's it's a hard time to have babies in the NICU, and so um, I felt really fortunate. Fortunate for what mom Caitlin Bunch calls liquid gold. Breast milk donated by women across the country to the milk bank here at St. Luke's Hospital, Kansas City. It is important that we have that milk to be able to supplement as a bridge to mom's supply or as a supplement to mom's own supply. They look so good. Neonatologist Dr. Barbara Carr is in charge of the bank, which in the last five years has dispensed more than 500,000 ounces of donor milk to hospitals across the country. And the demand is growing as NICUs care for more babies born at earlier stages. And what we know is that babies who are fed human milk uh, are healthier. Uh, they have uh, fewer need for uh, the long-term IV fluids that we give them. They have lower incidences of infection. They have lower complications with their feedings and their tummies. And their hospital stays are shortened. The milk bank follows strict guidelines, testing. Allie's taking calculations. Screening all donations for diseases or anything that might potentially harm a baby. The donations are then pasteurized, then tested again. Finally mixed to ensure the calorie count remains high. Babies that get this don't drink very much in a day. To feed the most vulnerable. It is uh, recognized as a continued life-saving um, part of the care that I can give. <laughs> now 10 months old, both Vivian <laughs> and Helen are happy and healthy. And mom Caitlin has decided to give back. Though, becoming a recipient of donor milk um, made me realize just how important and how special and what a great gift that was. Donating some of her milk, helping babies in the same situation her daughters were in less than a year ago. I felt really good and really proud to be able to do that. In Kansas City, Ariel Rothfield, 41 Action News. It really is liquid gold. The milk bank only accepts donations within the first year your child is born.